As promised in the book, I'm going to show you here how to insert a zoom um, to make that a bit more pictorial. All right, first I go here uh, and create a new zoom from the insert tab and I opt for a summary zoom. And I say, these are the slides of my presentation. I only want some of them, which would be this one, this one, and that one. Click Insert. And I get a new slide. I can add a title like my summary zoom. And here I have the pictures of the slides. Um, that doesn't seem to be very nice from here, but I go down um, to the presentation, to the slideshow view now. And then you see, clicking here to that one, it zooms in. This is actually the slide. It's not just the picture, it is the slide. I click and then it zooms back. I go to the next one. And if I had made it a section zoom, I would play all the slides that belong to that section, but this time it's only a single slide. I hit the escape button and I see here, these are the section, a slide with a chart and all of them. Uh, sometimes people work with them uh, quite a lot. I seldom do it, but now they finally make sense for before they did not. This is the one part. And maybe I should show you also the thing here, uh, as I explained in the book, um, how the morph works. I had here that one slide with a black cloud, and then I copy that slide. Um, and then on the new slide, I only change the color, the position, and the size of the clouds. I copy the same cloud um, to some more ones. And now I go back to the slideshow view. And it looks like this. I now click and in fact, as you see, we're going to the next slide, but it looks like this. And I think this is a really nice thing to do. One doesn't need to be a, or to play it that playful, but I think that's a nice example how to use it.